you know, yeah, uh, you know, like uh, yesterday morning was probably the first time I probably dropped in the urban stream. Well, you know, it was live, shit like that. I was talking there with fellow Phil. Yeah, Urban called me out and said, "Oh, you'd like talking to pounds?" Like, you know what? You know, Urban has every right to call me out. You know, I probably, you know, I video, so I'll call him out by his behavior like that. That's how I am. I'm the type of person I call out. You know, disgusting behavior doesn't mean you know, I hate the person. No, I don't hate nobody. I have no hate. Well, I have no hate for anybody. Like I said, you know, when I see something fucked up or something's bullshit, you know, I when I smell bullshit, I smell something fucked up. I'm gonna call it out. I'm gonna say what it is. You know, sometimes it's called my opinions, sometimes it's called basis, and sometimes, sometimes when it's facts or facts, I'm going to show the facts on the table. Anyway, it's enough of that shenanigan. So, yeah, you know, I bring a point, you know, uh, you know, you know Jethro Sater and you got Kevin and your know, brother. You know, uh, you know, Jethro has a channel, you know, Jethro Sater, and called I love, I love uh, Flat Earthers, you know. He's been going live the last couple of days, you know. I, you know, I, you know, he's making these videos by Urban. You know, I mean, I made a couple videos, but this guy makes pop and, and all and every other video he makes by Urban. You know, some of that. You know, when I was checking word, I don't have a problem. I you know have it all. But, you know, I had a little problem when he was, you know, talking. You know, you know, talking. You know, trying to silence. You know, but Mike True I and mean, you know talking shit by Aaron. You know, I thought okay. You know, so you know, the more I realized, so I don't. What's up? What's up? What's up with this cat? Really. So I can see why Urban's all trash. So I'm calling him out. Of course, you know Kevin all acts all big on his own panel, but he gets destroyed by Urban. But the problem I had yesterday was when he was talking about, oh yeah, black men or you know people you know foreign, uh, you know like out of countries like that. Oh, if they come from our country, we should lynch them. Like whoa, 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 whoa. I had a huge problem, and I started and I, you know, I was taking like with fail, fail, and I'm. The fellow fail was an afterthought when you know when Kevin started talking about lynching, you know, different race of people that are not American and stuff like that. You know, Mike Seor was you know calling him out, and I was, I was in the chat like, who like what the fuck are you, Kevin? You're like you have you're talking about this shit like that. Everybody was screaming in the chat about one like Kevin, you know, and then Jethro. Then he had his little woman like that. He saying, oh, you retired like yeah, I say. First of all, you're talking about wanting to lynch people like that, different race and prerog prerogatory, shit like that. So that's why I had a huge problem like that with, you know, Kevin Jethro like that. I mean, plus, you know, a lot of people sitting there saying, and I was watching a little of Mike Truth like that, and this guy is a Satan worshiper like that. You know, it makes me think in my mind, I think this guy, right in my, in my right mind, he would fit so well in with No Sack Low Day. Well, he probably would fit a little bit with Fellow Fail. I think he would. Shit. What the hell am I thinking? Fellow fail probably always recruited Kevin Jethro to say, "Hey, you should." We said we should have we should have bromance fest in the back of the uh, no sack little van. Yeah, you know, larping it up each other. Yeah, cheap for as the shell the shell. Yeah, so I got it with fellow fail. He make all this bullshit, you know, cocks and like that. I got the screenshots. And that's for another video and another time. I was making this video address about. You know how twisted and fucked up in the in the brain, and I think Kevin is about one. He's about one fuck up away to be a fifty one fifty. You know, for seventy two hour hold. What's a fifty one fifty? It means when you're medically, you know, it's when you mentally into the system. Well, they call it mentally retardation as well. Colt one is he's legally a fifty one fifty himself, and I think Jethro and Kevin Sater. Or they're at one fuck up away from becoming medically and legally 5150 in the state of the law where they live at. I had enough of that shit. I'm out of here. Mike, y'all. Peace out.